happy Friday, everyone. Thank you so very much for tuning in today. Today, I am going to give you a quick review on the four new fall scents that I have purchased. Now, um, today, Bath & Body Works are having a $5.95 sale. So I went in and bought the rest of the collection and a whole bunch more. So I will review that next week. So if you are an oldie but a goodie and you're tuning in, thank you so very much for coming back. And if you are new, please push the subscribe button and the notification button if you would like to read up on more or see more of this content every time I upload. So thank you so very much. So this is going to be the four that I have and it is going to be in order from my least favorite to the favorite to my favorite. So let's begin now my number four pick it is going to be wrapped in sunshine my bath and body works now um for this fragrance here it has golden citrus white peach and blonde woods i thought it was going to smell good i got it everything is a complete blind buy and for this fragrance here um, it smells like potpourri. It smells like a plug-in. It smells like air freshener. Um, it's not horribly bad, but, um, I really don't want to walk around and smell like a plug-in or potpourri. Um, I'll probably play with it and um, mix it with another fragrance to see if I can like fix it however I have been using it as an air freshener I'm not even gonna lie um, it does not smell good on the skin um, oh it just smells like an old bowl of potpourri dry potpourri at that nasty so um, wrapped in sunshine it's not wrapped in sunshine it's wrapped up in leaves dirt and potpourri that's what this is wrapped up in and this is the one that i did not get a second one of and it's going to stay that way so this one is my least favorite it's not horribly horribly bad but it could have been better so that's number four Number three, it is fairy tale. I had high hopes for fairy tale, and um, personally, it smells like nothingness. It has um, pomegranate nectar, um, fresh orange blossom, vanilla bean, and warm amber. It has warm nothing. It's better than wrapped in sunshine however it's really weak like even on the skin i sprayed it on before i started this video so i really you know wouldn't say that it smells like nothingness but it, it does it smells like nothingness and out of all the four that i have this one here it was what 1650 and the rest were 1550 and have paid an extra dollar for nothingness but it smells a little bit better than my number four wrapped in sunshine so fairy tale it was just a bland story of nothingness so that's number three it is sweet cinnamon pumpkin now, Sweet Cinnamon Pumpkin, um, I thought it was going to, or I had hopes of it smelling like a bakery scent or like food. However, with this one here, it's more perfumey. And the reason why it's number two, it smells pretty good. On the skin, it's more of like a masculine, unisex smell. It's... Um, it has um, heirloom, pumpkin, autumn, cinnamon, ginger snap, and whipped vanilla. Now, 
it's really not that sweet. It's like a dark, cozy sweet. And that's why I like it. Now, I did get a second one because um, I'm sure because it's fall, it's going to smell real good if I mix it up with a deeper, darker vanilla scent. So, my number two pick is Sweet Cinnamon Pumpkin. And this one, technically, it really does last a long time. That's why I also like it too. So, that's my number two pick. Now, my number one pick it is crisp morning air and anything with air and i've already indicated that i do not like the smell of outside and i read the notes and it was a crisp fall breeze a golden amberwood and juicy apple so i really didn't you know feel that it was going to smell like outside or chlorine or some other crap like that so when I did spray it, I was completely shocked. It smells like a juicy, juicy apple. It smells like my Nobel 1942 perfume that I have. And I did mix it. And it smells like identical to it. And it's really, really good. The lasting power is not as long as the cinnamon pumpkin or the sweet cinnamon pumpkin. However, it smells really, really good. It smells like the skin and the inside of a juicy red apple. And that's why it is my number one. And I'm going to layer this and mix this with a lot of stuff. So, out of your money, your best bet. For me personally, it would be the Chris Morning Air and the Sweet Cinnamon Pumpkin. The other two I can live without. However, it's in my collection. I don't think that I'll get rid of it. I'll just use it as a as an air freshener. Probably going to bring it in the car with me today and spray it in the car and see how it lasts. So this pretty much wraps it up. When I do receive the large haul that I actually got today, I will review it next week. So thank you so very much. Have a wonderful, wonderful weekend and I'll see you next week.